Hey everyone, thank you for tuning in. Hey ladies, have you ever done a surprise sexy belly dance for your lover for Valentine's Day? Well, if yes, maybe it's time to do this again. And if not, hey girl, why not? Is your guy really not worth it? Anyway, this sweet idea comes from one of the Sweet Move subscribers, Nicole Brandt. She left a comment to my last video and asked, can you please do a sexy belly dance routine for Valentine's Day, maybe with some veil? And after my first answer was all like, hey girl, I don't do orders, I only do inspiration. I actually really love the idea and ta-da! Hey Nicole, thank you. I had fun creating this. The process felt inspired to me and now you tell me if the result feels inspiring to you. In this video we're not gonna get too technical, we're just gonna relax and enjoy the seductive side of belly dance. So a couple of pretty simple but sweet and sexy looking moves are going to constitute our routine that I'm going to teach you in this video. As you see there is some veil but we're not gonna exercise any particular veil skills either. We're just gonna make a mysterious appearance covered with veil and then we're gonna slow dance uncovering ourselves. And that's it. This tutorial does not include a warm-up or any stretch breaks, this time I leave it completely up to you. So you go ahead and warm yourself up and come back here. So for our first move we're gonna stand feet together, knees soft, pelvis slightly tucked and we're gonna move our chest in this infinity pattern. So arms up, shoulders down and here we go. Moving our chest in the figure 8 pattern. For now our weight is distributed evenly between both feet, but now let us get bigger with that chest so that you're forced to shift that weight from one leg to the other and now you see that you have to engage your powerhouse even more to stay nice and stabilized and don't, not fall to the side. So engaging your powerhouse more, moving that chest in figure 8 pattern. And we can go ahead and speed this up a little bit. Holding our arms up, we do this move holding the veil behind ourselves. Thus the arms up. And we can also change level with this. Going a little bit deeper. And lifting up again. And practicing for some more. This looks like a candle flame in the wind, so we're gonna call this move candle. And then we're gonna go ahead and get a little bit faster. So in our today's routine you will see there is no particular order that we do the moves. Let's float the hand in front, we do this still covered with veil and we float our hand in front. This is the first move. I think we're ready for the next one. We're gonna circle our hip. So standing on one leg, the other leg with pointed foot is placed front and we just circle the hip like this. Twisting it in and sideways. And we're gonna add a little bit more force in that middle. Pulsing it up as we're circling up. And circle up. Well, this is also pretty straightforward, but oh my, does that look sexy. Mm -hmm. Let's do the other side. Just circling, holding the arms back, imagining the veil. Let's go ahead and add that pulse. Yeah, baby, look at my hip. Couple more. So, as I already said, there's no particular order. The music that I chose allows us to do it in the order that we like. So we can actually do the hip up, down and circle. Let's do the other side up, down, circle. One more time the side up, down, circle. Let's switch side and do this again. Up, down, circle. And our third sexy sweet move is going to be the running step shimmy or the choo-choo shimmy. Just step left, right, left, right and hips are going side to side and we do it really fast. And this you can also do at your own comfortable speed. You can do it chilled or a little bit faster to create more vibration. And we turn around with this 
showing herself off because this is the point of this performance, right? And turn in another direction. So, in the second part I demonstrate those moves in this particular order, but as I already said, you can do it in the order that you like. The music allows you to do this. The music that I chose. So let's do all of the moves together, the candle, and the hips, up, down, circle, other side, up, down, circle, and the running step, shimmy turn around, let's do this with veil, so let's grab our veil, let's bring it Grab it between, between both hands and bring it behind. I'm gonna just circle it around. We can bring it behind ourselves and in front of ourselves like this. Let's reverse direction. Bring it in front and then behind. So bring it behind one more time. Let's do the candle. Changing the level and the hips. Circle other side. Inception, turning, enjoying the veil, embracing our body. I'm gonna do it one more time. Candle, the hips, the right step shimmy, and then I'm gonna show you one more move that is going to showcase our femininity and curves. So the hips. One more time, this side, the hips. And run a step shimmy turn, and then you will see in the second part we also just turn and we turn, and we're gonna bring the veil around in front and throw the upper body foot down, and then circle the shoulders and throw the body up, the veil up, and circle the shoulders. So, this we do when we uncover ourselves, but we also do the candle with our face covered and tease a little bit. So, girl, you don't forget do this one in your performance and then we just turn still keeping the mystery and turn and now I'm going to show you how we cover ourselves with the veil so let me just take a sip of water I'm going to just show you once and thanks to the magic of video recording you can watch it as often as you need to get it so we're going to Grab the veil between both hands. The distance, approximately like this, you just have to try it a couple of times with your own head. So, and we bring it behind. Bring it together, both hands, and grab them. With one hand, the other hand is making a little opening, so I can come close and show you. So, I am holding the two ends with my one hand. And the other hand is just creating a little bit, a little opening. I'm gonna bring it to my eyes and behind the head. I'm gonna grab two ends, two free ends, and adjust this so it looks nice. And I'm gonna show you the moves. So, we just enter facing sideways, we bring the arm front and then we circle the hand, we point the foot step, hand floats in front of the face, head side to side and then we step, transferring the weight, pushing the chest up in front, stretching the abs and then we step again, turn to the side and do this again. And this move you can also do a little bit faster or or slower or at the same speed as I do and do it three repetitions or more or less as you wish and you can also do this move after you've uncovered yourself I chose not to but you can do this and then we just turn around still covered with veil on relevé on flat foot whatever makes you feel more comfortable and stable then we turn in another direction and then we do the candle, floating the hand in front. 
front and then we're just gonna cross, step cross and turn and with free hand grab one end and the other hand let's go and we grab the other end and turn around holding the bell in front and then we do candle again change the level and we bring the hands back and up and still cover it, covering the face to the candle again and then we turn so now what about the ending and this I also leave up to you depending on who and why and when you're performing this for you can actually leave with a veil or you can dance lead your audience towards the bed or you can dance yourself close enough to him so he can just take you in his arms and go if you do actually perform this piece please do take a minute and come back to this video and leave a comment how you finished it because i would really love to know and i will love you forever if you do this so i wish you lots of fun your valentine's day have a great time have great sex and we're gonna see you soon